This is Prospect, the drill manufactured by Leonardo at the Nervianos plant, close to Milan, with which Italy will explore the moon's secrets. Prospect is only the latest space drill made in Italy, and is similar to the one manufactured by Leonardo for the Rosetta spacecraft's mission to Comet 67P and for ExoMars 2020 mission to Mars. Prospect is an essential element of the joint European-Russian mission Luna 27, led by Roscosmos and ESA, including both Italian and British space agencies. The Prospect drill, Proceed, contains a mini-scientific lab, Prospa, packed with European and Russian sensors and will drill moon surface looking for regolith and frozen water. Andrea Rusconi, head of space robotics engineering, Leonardo Electronics Division. It will drill generating a vertical translational spin and a rotation that will give enough power to break the hard surface of the moon, which is a mixture of small and medium-sized rocks with a small amount of frozen water between 6 and 12 percent. This means it has to drill for at least one meter below the surface, where scientists believe there are higher chances of finding water. Prospect, manufacturing alloy with a diamond point, is placed in a fiber carbon case and is powered by a 100 watt engine that allows the drill to rotate at 60 revolutions per minute. The environment in which it will operate is the south pole of the moon where there are higher probabilities to find water due to the very low temperatures, up to minus 150 degrees. A sample will be collected through a sample room, and it will be delivered to the Italian and Russian devices through a robotic arm. The sample will then be analyzed and the data is sent to scientists on Earth. The contract to manufacture Prospect is worth 31.5 million euros and was signed in Nerviano on Thursday. January 30, 2020, by Marco De Fazio, Deputy Managing Director of Electronics Businesses of Leonardo, and David Parker, Director of ESA's Human and Robotics Exploration Programs. Nerviano is a big hub of skills and expertise in robotics and robotics arms used for space exploration, including grilling systems that can collect and analyze samples. Luna 27 is a really exciting mission because it's our first attempt to land in the south pole of the moon and see if there really is water ice in the dust of our eighth continent, the moon. So it's a first step towards finding whether we can use the resources of the moon to go further into space, uh, to find where the water came from and also see whether we can use it for one day our human explorers. The ultimate goal for Lunar 27 is to look at the possibilities of establishing a human settlement on the moon that could also host Italian astronauts. Luca Palmitano is commander of the space station. With the decisions we made uh, just before Christmas at our ministerial conference, European astronauts will go fly towards the moon by the middle of this decade, and I really hope they'll be on the surface of the moon before the end of this decade. So there's an exciting 10 years to come.